hello again and welcome back. I, this time, am doing a new recording setup and I'll explain that after I explain my loadout. I've got the gravity staff, which I've come to like a lot, even though it's not amazing, and the double maces. These things are pretty awesome. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll show the gravity staff right there, 36 damage, nothing special. And these maces, however, fire damage and critter damage. The critter damage is nothing special, but um, this one has plus slowing as well as fire. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, having fire on anything is is nice, and the maces do so much damage. Uh, 89 to 90, those are some of the highest damaging weapons in the game. So that's awesome. Um, the double fire makes it even cooler. And I'm going to do the exo perk of, let's see, thinking about critical, I'm going to do critical, yeah, uh, adds 40% chance to increase melee damage by 200%, and I'm going to go ahead and do the thing, let's get it. So this recording setup of mine um, is, by the way, I, I just did Lava Forge a bunch on a video that is going to come out tier 1 to 6, but I'm not going to do Lava Forge, I'm going to do Underworld this time, and... This one looks like a pretty cool dungeon. So I'm gonna do this with the tier six difficulty and I think it's just every right turn, essentially. Yeah, it's right turns. But as you can see in the recording, um, it should look a little bit different. I have the, I'm recording from the MetaQuest developer hub uh, using the casting 2.0 and the Android developer bridge or whatever that thing, ABD over uh, Wi-Fi. I might have said a couple things wrong there. It's a lot of a lot of words. However, um, I think it's I think it's some nice stuff. Um, hopefully, hopefully it turns out well. Unfortunately, over this uh, MetaQuest developer hub, and you know what? I'm, oh, why why'd I do that? Whatever. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna use the staff. I don't even need a torch. How cool is that? Um, but. Yeah, so this developer hub that I'm using should be should be pretty cool. Um, should help out um, ugh, with some of the recording issues I've been having because I'm not just recording from the Quest headset. Also, that's crazy. Ooh, get away. Okay, let's see if he can like hit your friend. Hit your friend. Oh, oh, we didn't do it. Okay, that's fine. Oh, that's hurting me. That is hurting me. I'm gonna kill this guy first. And, yeah, he's dead. Kill this guy next. And now, hopefully, I don't die to these guys. This guy's fireballs. We're hitting, he's dead. Oh, pfft. That's my staff. Oops. Okay, he is dead. Good stuff. Um,. But yeah, so you should, in this recording, actually, let's see if I get a, I get a key. Uh, in this recording, you should see a little bit more uh, width to the recording. Um, and I think uh, height as well. So uh, it should be easier to see my hands, I think. And I'm, I'm kind of testing it as I go. I think I'm going to upload this video. Obviously, if you're watching it, it will be uploaded, but kind of just thinking aloud right now and I don't know why I'm collecting all these coins but I think I said go right all the time pretty sure so yeah I'm going right Let's see if I can you know what <laughs> this this room is easier to just use a torch it gives you a little bit more light um, but when you're going down that hallway back over in that other place and yay skeleton key and the map perfect uh, but the hallway, it's easier to just use a staff um, rather than lighting the torch. But it's still fun to light the torch, so, you know, to each their own. All right, now, let's see the map. Yeah, that was just one room, and we're going over here. But yeah, so in the past, when I recorded just from the headset, not my computer connected to the headset. So basically, right now, I'm casting from my computer to my headset uh, over Wi-Fi. But... Um, when it was just from the headset, I don't think you could see as low as you should be able to see right now in that 
I don't have to look way down to look at my hands, but instead I can just leave them down by my hips and you should be able to see them a little bit. And same with like how wide the camera is and how, if you can see my hands there, cause I can't see my hands right here, but I can right here barely and so on and so forth. Um, give me this key, some gold, kill that, and then open the chest. Where are we going next? I'm gonna go this way. Oh, bone cutter, cool. To this stuff we go. All right, give me some more potions that I don't need. Nice, nice. Kill the spider first, because he's easy, and right as I say that, I get poisoned by him. Dead. That's the bonus of criticals. Kill those purple guys pretty easily. That guy sliced me for, what, four damage? Ah, okay. Alright. Come here, and bam! Oh, that didn't even kill him. Kinda lame. There we go. But yeah, I haven't really had to use my gravity staff. And haha, he's hitting his teammate. Hit your teammate. Oh, wow. I missed that. Alright, well, that's fine. Lots of scythe guys. Interesting. I would love to have a scythe myself. That would be a cool weapon. Just not a thing yet. Ah, do we got more? We got more. Alright. Here we go. Ugh. Ah, he got up quicker than I thought. There we go. Yeah, the thing about these maces, they are not the most long-ranged weapons, so you really gotta get down there uh, when the enemies are getting low to kill them when they're low. All right, now I go this way and this way. Fantastic. All right, and... Ooh. Yeah, that guy. Yeah, oh, shucks. There we go. <laughs> oh, shucks. Luckily, we slowed that guy. There we go. Fantastic. Ah! Waiter. <laughs> knock that guy down right when he gets up. Okay. Now, skeleton key in the socket. And... I don't even need these potions. What am I doing? Um, this way. Oh yeah, there's always a key right here. Good to have. I think I have an excess amount of keys, but that's okay. Okay. Oh! That's painful. I might die. Let me just drink a health potion. There we go. Oh, weird. Got him. I am full on keys. Fantastic. Aha. Okay. I think these fire axes are especially good in this dungeon because. I think I'm going this way. Um, oh, nice. Let me grab this key. Because there's a chest up at the top here. Ugh. My goodness. Yeah, maces are very nice for killing bats. Because they're, they're a little bit wide. Alright, let's see if I can grab this. Yes, I didn't kill myself. Fantastic. Okay. Bam. Into the chest. See what I get. Sacrifice my weapons for some better weapons. Kidding, that's not how it works. Okay, rare guard. That sucks. That's okay though. Um, where were we going? We're going to the bottom of here. I'm guessing that this isn't the end of the dungeon. However, it might. Nope, okay. Good. I figured it wasn't because it wasn't a huge room. Just a lot of bats, apparently. Oh! I accidentally grabbed the thing. Is that it? Okay. Just two. Two ice bats, man, that's lame. I want more. Uh -huh. Oh, there we go. Down the potion goes. Hey, look, you can still see it at the bottom. That's cool. 
I did not know that. Thought there was a key always in there, but nope. There's a key always right there. All right, go on up here and jump. Whee. Take some fall damage. What'd I take? About 16 damage. All right, into the end, the final room. And I, <laughs> I haven't been picking up gems, uh, just getting them from a couple of chests. So I think I'm gonna keep my gems just in case. I'm trying to find gems right now. Sometimes they're in vases. Uh, okay. Sometimes spiders are in vases too. All right, that's okay. We'll just we'll live without some gems. Oh just not have great stuff with the staff okay dead man Ugh. Ooh, got him got this guy oh man good good oh thought i picked up that mace right after i threw it Ugh. Okay, that guy needs to die. Haha. <laughs> guy just wasn't blocking himself. Okay. Important to kill this ice guy. Okay, he's dead. Kill this other ice guy. Otherwise they will kill me. Okay. Nice. Ooh. Did not see this guy. Nice. Where's my other mace? It's on the other side, okay. Oh, my goodness. Nice. Fantastic. Got him. Oh. Ah, I just killed him from bouncing off the ground. That's crazy. For you. That guy didn't die, what? <laughs> I guess I gotta slam him against the wall. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, let's see. Let's see if I can put this guy. Oh, I just put the gem on. Can I move him? No, I can't. And that just, each time I tap him, it just does a little tiny bit of damage. And there goes the staff. Yeah, that's. Gravity staff is not good for these big guys. But there we go. Alright. Good stuff. Put the batteries in the packs. Alright. Over and out. It was pretty, pretty nice run. Um, these these maces are very powerful, and this staff I just didn't do much with. <laughs> I feel like the gravity staff is ah, it can be so fun, but at the same time, there's there's times you'll use it and it just barely does anything. And yeah, it's I don't know. I'm conflicted when it comes to the gravity staff, but that's okay. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this recording comes out all right. And other than that, peace out.